Hello my dear students Previously we have seen exercise 3.2 we have completed it Now to start exercise 3.3 first of all we will have to know the divisibility test Divisibility test that you can check from here this link To check a number whether that number is divisible by a particular number or not Like if you want to check a number whether that number is divisible by 2 Whether that number is divisible by 3, 5, 8, 9, 10, 11 or not so to know that first of all you will have to go through this link because divisibility test is only there in this exercise okay we are starting exercise 3.3 in exercise 3.3 the first question is using divisibility test determine which of the following numbers are divisible by 2 3 4 5 6 8 10 and 11 so here it is not written 2 3 4 5 6 8 9 10 and 11 so the first one is already given that you will have to check whether that number this number is divisible by 2 or not here it is written 2 but not visible remember that it is given in your textbook so so this number is divisible by 2 then you will have to write yes if not divisible by 2 then you will have to write no so it is divisible by 2 that means it is written yes here then it is not divisible by 3 again it is not uh, yes divisible by 4 but not divisible by 5 so this you will have to know you don't have to divide the complete number you will have to check it whether that number is divisible or not divisible so for that only you will have to go through that link yes so i am directly giving you the answers you will have to practice it first with the help of that video okay so the answers of this are here are the answers okay so you can check your answers from here and then after that you'll have to write it in your notebook okay moving to the next question using divisibility test determine which of the following numbers are divisible by 4 and by 8 you, we will have to check which of the following numbers are divisible by 4 and 8 also so we are going with the first example um, this is not example question number one that is 572 so to check a number whether that number is divisible by 4 divisibility test by 4 what do we have to do we will have to take the last two digits of any number the number which is given we have to take the last two digits that means we will have to check 72 whether the 72 is divisible by 4 or not so we will divide 72 by 4 the answer is 18 and the remainder is 0 if the remainder is 0 that means it is completely divided by 4 that means this number that is divisible by 4 as its last two digits are divisible by 4 okay now we'll check the same number by 8 what do we have to do to check it by 8 agar humko 8 se divide check karna hai if you want to check it check the divisibility by 8 then we have to take the last three digits and only three digits are here that means we have to take the complete number and we will have to divide it by 8 and we will have to check it whether the number is divisible by 8 or not see 572 divided by 8 we got the quotient as 71 but remainder is not 0 that means it is not completely divided it is not completely divided that means it is not divisible by 8 so not divisible by 8 as its last three digits are not divisible by 8 hope you got the answer so how to check the next one question number b moving to the next one taking question number b 7 like 26352 to check the divisibility by 4 we will have to take only last two digits that means tens and ones that is that will be 52 if we check 52 divided by 4 yes it is completely divided by 4 because the remainder is 0 yeah so yes we can write divisible by 4 as its last two digits are divisible by 4 checking by 8 that means we will have to take the last three digits okay 352 so checking 352 yes it is also divisible by 4 sorry 8 that means it is the whole number 7 lakh 26352 is also divisible by 8 so we can write this number is divisible by 8 as its last three digits are divisible by 8 okay i am not showing you the question number c this you will have to practice it by your own but i'll give you the answers i am going to show you the question number d because the last two digits are zero and last three digits are also zero see checking question number d so divisibility test by four 
if we divide 0 by any number the answer is 0 if we divide 0 by any number see we have divided 0 by any number any number say 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 or any number in this world we can divide it because four zeros are zero so remainder will be zero if remainder is zero that means it is completely divided if it is completely divided that means the number is also divisible by four divisible by four as its last two digits are divisible by four if we take last three digits to check the divisibility test by eight then also it will be divided because i already said that zero is always divisible by any number in this world so divisible by 8 as its last three digits are divisible by 8 we can write a note here that is 0 is always divisible by any number okay 0 is always divisible by any number so question number C and other all remaining questions you will have to practice it by your own you'll have to practice it by your own and you can check the answer from here see these are the answers okay so you can check it from here but solve it in your notebook as I have given you in this way you have to solve it in this way okay we will move to the next question and that question we will see in the next video I hope you understand this video and uh, please practice it thank you